Well, it's time to get up leaves down here at the river. We uh, for years hauled them all from our home in our trailer in the back of our truck in those big leaf bags we use. And see, this is a common area. We have our picnics and barbecues, and we uh, have a little beach there. And we also hold church services here during the summer. And I'm going to get all these leaves up and put them on my garden, and I don't have to haul them all from home. And then this couple here is our age, and I will get those leaves up, and the lady next door's tree, I will get her leaves up because she's a widow, and then I will get the leaves up there. And that's a fair amount, and it'll cover a lot of my garden. Well, my son took an old canvas of his, uh, not really too old, and he wrapped up my console and my seats. You can tell from all the wind damage from the different storms that this is pretty shot. And we hope to get this covered today, but there's no big hurry. We've got uh, new bungees and a new cover. Well, we got down here about 10.30, and it's 5 minutes to 5 on Wednesday the 4th of November. I got the leaves off of this area for my neighbor. I cleaned this up as best I could. There's a lot of pine cones underneath those two trees, so I didn't do a lot with that. My bird is sitting in the cart. I will get that lady's yard, but I got the lady over there, and we're going to ride around the cart. I'll show you. Here's the other lady's uh, yard I did, and my bride said that uh, we got here at 12.30, not 10.30. So it's about 4 hours and 25 minutes, and we did talk to a man. I got a little around on this side. We'll run up the road here. Show you where I got the rest from. There's plenty of leaves if you want to get them. So you can see them laying along here. Up hardwood trees. And we did, uh, there's a man up working on another piece of property cutting trees down. We talked to him for probably 45 minutes getting a bid and he's going to take down two trees for us tomorrow. Hopefully the cart noise isn't too loud so that we can put in this newfangled septic system. A little quieter already on the pavement. Got some buzzards circling over there. The other source of my leaves are these four trees. There's actually a fifth one over there. There's a willow. I think it's two willows and the rest of them are oaks. And I got up on the right and left side of the road. And I got down the ditches and I did that whole yard all the way down to the other side of this house. around the block and that's our garden. And it's probably pretty loud but I'll show you what we did in about uh, you know four hours worth of me pulling the big bags around on the lawnmower. And that's about 10 inches. We got a big horseshoe here and uh, I just pulled the lawnmower through the garden and park at the other end, undo the bag, drop it down and pick the bag up sort of a third and the leaves at the top of the bag fall out and then the next section, next section. So I just come down and then I come down across to where I've already done there and another row and another row, no, no, no. Then we get over here we do the same thing. So I can right now turn around in there and drop the bag there. I don't have to drag it very far and I can just dump the leaves. It seems to work. Everything's still green. Uh, next, see, eight days from now, it's supposed to get down to 36. Today was what, 67? Uh, and yesterday, I think, was 72, so it's not been too bad. It's time to go up the country.